Welcome, everyone, and thanks for joining us in Philadelphia tonight. We're live from inside the Wachovia Center, home of the Flyers. I'm Bob Cole, and with me is Harry Neal. Thanks for tuning in to exciting NHL action here on the 2K Sports Network. The 2006 and 2007 season resulted in identical home and away records for the Rangers. They were 21-15-5, whether they played in New York or on the road. And now, your Philadelphia Flyers! Healy is a goaltender who likes to move around. His quickness is his best attribute. I know there are exercises you can do to try and improve your quickness, but as far as I'm concerned, this guy seems to be born with it. Here we go with the first drop of the puck. Opening period. And now, Philadelphia at center ice. Here's Nienemann. Slap shot. Doesn't get it on net. It's wide right. And now the Flyers grab it. Wow, this is a good hit. He took him out, then rattled his cage. He's got a great eye, great stick. In the slot. Now Sundstrom. Out of the corner. Fired. The defense comes up big to block the shot attempt. I'll tell you what, Bob, this... The goal stick to the rescue knocks that away. Oh, and the puck went off the post. He just got metal. This game is still tied. Oh, what a chance for New York now. In the slot, the Rangers steal it. Stolen by Philadelphia. Still in his rookie year. Renberg fires. Here we go. The pass missed. And the Flyers touch up icing as the call. Eric Lindros may have been a linebacker if he was a football player because on skates he has the ability to intimidate the opponents he faces. He's big, he's strong, and he's mean. Face off will be at the left of the net as the players get ready. To the point. He shoots. He gets it. Richter, he covers the puck and will have a face off. Face off coming up. Ready to get the action started. And Philadelphia regains the puck on the offensive. It's tipped towards the net, but he makes that stop. We've got a moment now for tonight's Copper Stopper Replay. Brought to you by Duracell. Usually the redirected shot is a good way to score. But in this case, Coley, maybe he should have left it alone. Right, Harry. That puck ended up right in the goalie's big padded frame. And there aren't many hockey players out there that can shoot a puck hard enough to go through that. And even if they were, that's a spectacle I can live a long time without seeing. Past the blue line. Podine, and the attempt by Brindamore, stopped. New York looking to get on the scoreboard. Oh man, did he get nailed. What a big time hit. Tyrion. It's in! What a goal! And what a great way to start this game. These guys wanted to make a statement early, and they've done just that. Jumping out to a one nothing lead here in the first. He got real close to the net, made the decision to shoot, and that's the end of that story. He was so close to the goaltender that there's not much he could do unless his positioning cuts off all the angles. And that's the advantage of moving out of ways from the goal, to cut down the angle. Flyers are leading by just one. That's a goal! And they get a two-goal lead here early in the first. This game is starting out to be a fast pace run. Beautiful one-timer, Coley, but it couldn't have turned into a goal without that incredible timing on the pass. Oh, no kidding. He just pauses a bit and then makes the pass. And the goalie could not make the stop. That was a bullet shot. The nice puck movement really set up the goal nicely. That was a great play. The Flyers are putting some distance between themselves and their opponents early here tonight. 
That gives them a two-goal lead. Here's Nenema. He's got one assist. And the Flyers are bringing it up. It stopped. The shot deflects off the goalie. Zubris. Richter stops it. Crossbow now. And now the Rangers win. New York moving up. Nets it off. Behind the goalie. 6.41 of the first period. Philadelphia with a two-goal lead. Philadelphia forcing the play. They get it away. And the Flyers pick it up. The Rangers turn it over. The Rangers are not where they want to be right now. It's the first period. You're not supposed to be playing catch-up. And they're down big time. Harry wants killing their game here tonight. Bob, it's not the lack of good goalie work for this team. The net has been pretty well protected, but they trail, and if they want to make a comeback, it's going to start with better offense. Richter stops it. He was aiming bottom left, but no room. There it is, New York on the move. Bob, you and I live for hits like this. A super open ice body check. Richter holds on. Good positioning on this play. We'll see it on the replay, Bob. He made the save with his body and really didn't have to move that much. Goaltenders sometimes get their positioning by using strings at practice that they connect to the post. It looks like he was in the right position. That's exactly what you want to do. Nice stop. Center ice. Graves up ice, 2 on nothing. Clapp skating with it now in his own zone. He scores on the breakaway. What a play he made to beat the goaltender. And it goes off the goaltender and ends up in the net for a goal. I know this happens from time to time, Harry, but that fact certainly can't help the goalie now. Definitely not. Bob, in fact, looking at this replay, you can actually see the look of horror when he realizes that the puck hit him and still went in. There's a little period of time between that little tap of the puck and the signal for a goal. And that period of time feels like forever to the goalie. And I'm sure it's accompanied by a sinking feeling in the pit of your stomach as well. And Philadelphia has it at center. And New York gets possession. Oh, and there they go, the Rangers on the attack. Down low. Well, the tie. Stolen by Philadelphia. Well, the Flyers are in control of this one right now. It's deflected off the post. And brought to you by Duracell, our copper stopper replay. Harry, that was a nice save. A lot of this was good positioning with the blocker. We'll take a look at the replay of the breakaway save. Yep, he did it with his blocker. That blocker is not the easiest thing to put on the puck. You've got to have that backhand going, and that's exactly what happened there. Tremendous save. That was a real nice blocker stop, Bob. Richter gets set to defend as they face off to his right. Philadelphia grabs it at the point. And it was stopped by that right pad in the corner, Lindros. They shoot again. Off the post. He hit the post. Otherwise, it would have been a four-goal lead. Now the Flyers get it back. Tyrion has it. The shot was wide left as it almost dinged off that post. Remember, this guy is not known for his hitting ability, but he did a pretty good job here with that open ice body check. That hit the goal post. New York looking to get on the scoreboard. Coffey gains possession in the defensive zone. In the neutral zone. New York regains possession. Fired! Stop with the blocker. Svoboda. And the Flyers are on the move. Shot wide to the left on that one. Now New York's got it. Eastwood. New York loses it. Svoboda. The Rangers steal it. And the Rangers coming in. Two minutes left in the period. Knocks that shot away with a goal stick. Bird controlling the puck. Hextall shuts down that play with a poke check. Now Lindros with it. Fires coming in. Shoots wide right, not on goal. The pass went nowhere.
Langdon decided to pay a visit to the other team. He got sent over the boards with that hit. First period over. Now moving on to period two with the Dodge intermission report. Dodge, grab life. The Flyers have been really playing exceptional hockey here tonight, Harry. They came out with the early lead in the first period and are riding with confidence in total control. What are the keys to their success, Harry? This team has done an exceptional job of turning offensive opportunities into goals, and the scoreboard reflects that success pretty clearly. When you convert offensive situations into great shots, and here they've done that so well, you can score. And when you score like they have here tonight, you win the game. We're ready to start the second period of play here tonight. He is just in his first season. Sundstrom handles it. New York forcing the play. Shoots wide. He's got it at the point. The puck's out front. Hextall with a stop. He blocked off the left side there. Hextall, he covers it up. They're ready for the faceoff. Philadelphia dominating here tonight. And here's Brindamore. Philadelphia with this opportunity. Fired! Shoots just to the right, nearly hitting that goalpost. Samuelson with some good stick work, poking it out. He's hip checked. No luck on that pass. Kovalev. Philadelphia picks it up. Here's Nieneman. And the Flyers take it away. And what a save. He misses the pass. Nobody there. Kovalev has it in the corner. Rangers can't hang on to it. Now Philadelphia. Samuelson skating with it now in his own. The puck in the defensive zone. And the Flyers are bringing it up. New York looking to get on the scoreboard. To the point. And Lindros nails him. Taken away by Lindros. Center ice. And the Flyers are on the move. He shoots. Oh, baby. He shut him down on that breakaway. Taken away by Philadelphia. It's shot. Fired wide left on that one. Not on goal. A fine puck handler. And New York over the line. Shot. Hextall with a stick save. In the spits position, he pulls off the stick save. Now here he uses all the weapons, Bob. The goalie goes down and does the splits and then makes a great stick save. He has down low covered, but his movement is severely limited. So in this case, he's got to reach out and make that stick save, Harry. Oh man, Coley, that's great stuff. Hextall braces for the faceoff near his goal. And the Rangers win it. Leach has the puck at the point. Coffee. Crossbill now. Oh, and here's Philadelphia. They shoot again. Just left of the goalpost and misses. And the save is made. Powerchuk gets control of the puck in his own zone. He's got one assist. Sundstrom handles it. Along the boards, Veslav crossbow. Always dangerous. Another shot. Saves it with a stick. And the Rangers coming in. Boy, you talk about delivering a big-time body check. He just rattled his bones with that one. Philadelphia trying to get set up once more. Fires wide right. No luck there. The puck went off the post. Richter covers up after the shot. Now this save we're about to see is simply good technique. Have a look at it. The keeper is set and ready on this one, Harry. He knows where the puck is. He knows where the players are on the ice. And he uses his stick well to defend against the shot. Yeah, he's locked right in. This is a solid play on the part of the goaltender to deny them a goal. And the Flyers win it. And the 
the Rangers are bringing it up. Oh, and here come the Rangers. He gets it. Hextall play stops as he covers the puck. Hextall prepares to protect the left side of the goal. Otto gains possession in the defensive zone. Philadelphia dominating here tonight. Flyers coming in, and they go offside. The Rangers have just been doing terribly at winning faceoffs tonight. And they're ready now for the faceoff. And it's picked up by Philadelphia. Dykhaus still in his rookie year. And Philadelphia brings it back in with a bad shot wide to the right side. And now the Rangers will get back on side. The pass into open ice. Tyrion picks up the loose puck in his own zone. Here it is, Philadelphia on the move. Oh, the shot hits the post, and New York has the puck. Flatly. Now Philadelphia with it again. Pins him up against the board. The pass missed. It's loose. He's got the puck in his own zone. Philadelphia forcing the play. To the middle. It hits a player and then up off the glass. Is held against the glass. The Flyers steal it. And now the Rangers with it. Through the zone with the puck. Less than a minute to go in the period. To the point. He's got the puck at the point. Philadelphia moving up. It's a goal! And he gives his team the four-goal lead here late in the second period. This has become something of a goal fiesta here tonight. Oh, wow. Talk about getting off at the end of the line. They couldn't have cut that one any closer. Great for the fans out there watching. Everybody loves a buzzer beater, even if the game isn't over yet. I don't know if it's the case here, but sometimes defenses can let up a little when the game clock is ticking down like that. And that's the time to attack. I think they saw a little opening somewhere. And boy, are they glad they took it. And we're ready for the face-off. The buzzer sound signaling the end of the second period. We've got a score, four to nothing. Second period of hockey is complete. Now it's time for the Dodge period two intermission report. The Flyers are continuing their great play tonight, Harry. It's been a pretty one-sided match. They've got the big lead here, continuing to control the game as we start the third period. Where have they excelled, do you think, in your mind? They've been impressive thus far in face-offs, Bob. When you start with the puck this often, you're already at an advantage because it's a lot easier to get your offense set up. The Flyers beating out now for period three. Are looking very confident and ready to put this one away. They're having a terrific game right now. Here we go, the third and final period. A soft one by Bob Brindamore. Controlled at center. Brindamore, he's got one goal tonight. Sundstrom handles it. Hard body check. He scores! Trimming that four-goal deficit now to three. It's a little sign of light, and they need that right now here in the third. It's something like that goal that can save your dignity. Here's the replay on the attack situation on that goal, Bob. The goalie gets into a crouch position, knowing he's got an outnumbered attack. And it just isn't enough to keep this one from going in. The Rangers have brought the score differential down to three. The trouble now is they battle not only the opponent, but the clock here in the third period. The puck is stopped. Sundstrom's hit. 
A good shoulder hit between the blue lines. And now the Flyers with it. Turnover, Flyers. Taken away by Philadelphia. Kovalev will come on with the offensive shift change. Philadelphia with this opportunity. He stops it. Boy, he sure took the low part of the net away on this one. He did the splits and got the puck with his body. Graves. Now New York. Philadelphia dominating here tonight. Centered. Oh, and it stopped. It looked like he was beaten until he got that with a stick. Out front. How much focus did it take to make that offensive play? He dove and got the shot off and then was robbed by the left pad. And the Rangers touch up. Icing is the call. Lidster has a plus-minus rating in tonight's game of minus three. Hextall in goal, ready on the right side for the faceoff. Now Lindros with it. At center. Flyers, here we go. And Healy with a fantastic glove save to stop that one-timer. Healy covers up. Here's an expert move in net, Bob. He shows poise, patience, and then blinding reflexes to get his glove on that puck. Definitely a show-stopping move. He set himself up and was prepared for the shot and told that three-inch piece of vulcanized rubber, hey, you're not getting in here this time. No way. And he was able to get on top of that puck. Some great action in net tonight as we present the Copper Stopper replay brought to you by Duracell. Now here he uses all the weapons, Bob. The goalie goes down and does the splits and then makes a great stick save. He has down low covered, but his movement is severely limited. So in this case, he's got to reach out and make that stick save, Harry. Oh man, Coley, that's great stuff. LeClaire. And the Rangers are bringing it up. Stolen by Eric Lindros. And the Flyers coming in. And it's deflected off the right pad. Knocks that shot away with a goal stick. And the Rangers coming in. Here's Nicholas Sundstrom. He makes a save. This is a great example of full extension with the left pad on that breakaway save. And Philadelphia over the line. He centers it. Leach stops that centering pass, picking it off perfectly. He shoots, fires it back. He's got one assist. Lindros has got it. Oh, and Healy makes it. And he scores to put them up four here in the third period. That one looks like it'll just be icing on the cake as they post to the W. We have to look at this one again, Bob. It was a pinpoint pass. It sure was, Harry. And as soon as the puck got to the shooter, it was a goal. That's the way it should be. You almost know sometimes, beating the puck like that, if you've got a man in position to shoot, you're going to have a great opportunity to score. And they did just that here. That they did. The Flyers have all but sealed off the victory here tonight with that goal. You don't see a lot of four-goal comebacks, and I doubt we're going to see one tonight. Svoboda, he has it along the board. Hard body check. Fired. Shoots wide to the right. No luck there. And a personal performance tonight for the New York Rangers. Well, they need to take a hard look at some tape after this one, Bob. Obviously, either they didn't execute when they needed to, or they need a new approach to beat these guys. The goalie kept getting beaten, the defense couldn't take the pressure off them, and now they're looking at some lopsided numbers on the scoreboard. Flatley. And here come the Rangers. And the Philadelphia Flyers coaching staff happy with this performance. Taken in, and the Flyers pick it up. The Flyers turn it over to the point stolen by Philadelphia. Rangers, here we go. Now Philadelphia's got it. Philadelphia dominating here tonight. Deflected off the post. 
in front. Oh, and crossbow shot a stop. And now the Rangers with it. Turnover, Flyers. Here we go now with New York. Oh, and he gets checked hard. That hit is our Dodge Nitro hit of the game, folks. Philadelphia needs to get back on side. Fed out from the corner. Nice save. He misses the pass. They really put the pedal to the metal on this one and pulled away to a real nice lead. Their offense is just flat out getting it done. They refuse to beat enough. They get called for offside. And it looks like they're ready to get things going again. And the faceoff taken by Philadelphia. The puck in the defensive zone. Desjardins. Oh, a chance for Philadelphia now. And he fires it. His shot almost hits the left goal post. No luck on that pass. We're left with a minute 59 in deep. Taken away by Brenda Moore. And the Rangers take it away. Podine gets control of the puck in his own zone. It's shot just left of the goalpost. It's tipped and saved. He makes the save. And the Flyers coming in. Back to the point. And Brenda Moore now. Gloved by Healy. Healy, he decides to hold on to the puck. Let's examine this save a little closer, Bob. It's almost like he knew exactly where the puck was headed before it was even shot. This is the kind of save, Harry, that doesn't make the highlight reel, but it's the kind that the coach likes to see. Anything that saves the skipper a heart attack is definitely a good thing. And this hockey...